when a hurricane comes, you don't know what way it comes. You don't know if it's left, if it's right. And wherever it finds a weak spot, that's where it comes. My name is A. Maurice. This is my home, blown away. And this is all what I had right here. Ain't nobody that never thought it was gonna be ever like that. We always have like little small winds and little small, small stuff, but we never have it like that kind of way. First we was trying to get to the house. From the house, we had to come back to the vehicle and we had to stay there for a little while, then we had to skip from one vehicle to the next, one vehicle to the next, and then we have to cut through, through the pine, by our next neighbor house, and that's where all of us had to stay there. But when you stand in here, in the middle of the wind, tent flying, plywood flying, whatever flying, you gotta duck, you gotta lay down. If the plywood on top of you, you have to stay there, tell, the wind dies down, then you can move. My job, I'm an operator, I run heavy equipment. And I run mostly all the machines out there for them, and that's my job. I still is run machine because we had plenty of stuff with containers flip over, and I had to unflip them back on the legs, and trucks would flip over, and I had to fix them up and start cleaning up the place and stuff like that. Make sure everything goes right. Everybody got hands on deck, you know, and everybody cleaning up, you know, make it be how it's supposed to be. Because you can't live around where you got all this mess and stay there and just watching it just every day you pass by. But at least you got to get it clean, you know. I got a plan drawing for my house and I stick to it. So I have my property in Marshavo. That's where my mind paused to build my house, my new house for my kids. You have to have a place where you to lay your head and you'll get all your kids and everybody will come back and my sister will come. Once they're from Canada and all of that from the States and they'll be happy. 